I'll bring that up out of there, Rex. We, uh, for Lake of the Woods, we're technically targeting muskies, but it's really interesting. It's kind of an underrated thing here. I've said this for years, actually, but there's just some beautiful pike around. And this is one of these days that, uh oh, well, he had it. He's got to get it back. But this is one of these days that these, these big pike are up and they're literally set up basically exactly on a We've caught three on rocks, I think, and two on weeds, but they're they're set up right where a big muskie would be. It's really interesting to me. I just said that after he hooked this fish. Perfect on a rock point here, right, with the wind coming in right on the tip of it. And I don't know, it's uh, technically, I guess, it's not what you want, but we're actually having a pretty exceptional day with the Esox here. And uh, Rex is going to show us this. Oh, yeah, that's a nice one, bud. Nice fish. Pretty good size. Yeah, they're they're fat across the back too. I mean, they really are. He's gotta be like 53. Fifty-three. Yeah. <laughs> this is the same guy that a little while ago said my pike was small. It's just pike day, Rex. Not too bad. You got anything to say? Are you happy for me? It's small. <laughs> it's small, he said. Well, Rex is thinking big. I like that. Way too small. He just raised a four-foot muskie, so I guess he's getting a little... Uh oh now he's going to hit me with the net. There's a nice one, nice one, nice one. Get him over, get him over, get him over. That was a nice he one. He hit it too, I felt it, I thought it was weeds. <laughs> that was a good one, dude. Hey, got him, got him, got him, got him. Boy. Keep him out. You gotta get this one in the back for him, David. Yep. Come on. Well, I'll tell you what. That is not a monster, but sometimes you don't want to start with a monster because then, you know, you got nothing to beat. You know, if you started with like a 57 or something like that, you'd have to quit. And this way you can, you know, work your way up. But that was cool. Figure eight, man. That was awesome. That's my first muskie on a figure eight. So while Pete's on hooking that fish, we yesterday struggled. We were on a real, real uh, strong cold front. It was slow all week for a lot of the guests that were in in the lodge. And uh, we moved about four fish yesterday and some big pike that we'll show you guys. But uh, we finally got a muskie in the bag and we have moved how many fish this morning, boys? Oh gosh, uh, up to six. Six least, fish this morning. Six, I think seven actually. Seven fish this morning, so the fish are moving. 
And we got one in the bag. We finally got one in the bag. And it's a first figure eight fish for Rex, so that was great. <laughs> oh yeah, that's 35 all day. Now hold them out. You gotta remember to make them look big, right? But yeah, he's got that, that snaggle tooth thing. He probably got an injury when he was really young. But very nice, very seriously, congratulations, oh man, that is awesome. That is really cool. Our temperatures for this time of the year, 70 degrees. Off he goes. Well, that was neat. It's nice to see one in the bag. We're gonna work our way up from here. I'm hoping it was this hat switch. Uh, I think it was. You think maybe? I think it was. Yeah. It doesn't look bug. like leaves. Is it bugs? No, that's it's at least that one little patch. Oh, oh, oh. oh yeah, nice. Oh, yeah, you got down, him. Nice. Down. Head down, head down, head down. Keep the head down, head down. You got him. Good job. Hold on. Right on the finger. Hey. I'm in a. Yeah. <laughs> Good job, pal. Nicely done. So he's getting a grip on this fish. We just came out after a break. That's a nice, beautiful fish. Probably about a 41, I'd say. But we took a break after actually tons of action this morning. And uh, I believe this is the second spot. Saw one and then it come running in and smoked it. But let's get the fish back first. But just to finish up here, we, uh, I had no chance to even react to that fish at all. I mean, you guys, <laughs> next thing you know, I hear him scream, I hear Dave scream, and it's, you got him! And so, yeah, that what, was... what were you doing? Tell the story, because I didn't see any of it. I just heard the screaming. So. I was just reeling in, and then he didn't see him at first, and he come right up from the bottom and started to go into the figure eight, and he just hammered it. First corner? Didn't even get into a corner. <laughs> I like that. Right before the first corner, it started to go down. That is awesome. So that's his second one today. Actually, second fish, actually musky fishing, and the second one on the figure eight. Exploring. All kinds of spots we've never even tried before. Might not be the best time of night to be doing it, but... <laughs> been working. Oh, oh, dude. dude! The blade stopped spinning. Oh. <laughs> Some nice one, too. The blade just quit and I, oh. I couldn't. Yeah, just clear it out and get one in there. He's right in there. I was like, it's not spinning. Fix it and then. Oh, that was a nice fish. He wasn't. He wasn't. He was decent. Boy, he was hot as a son right. of a gun. Yeah. <laughs> he must have been. Just quit spinning. Did a float lead right there? I did. Yeah, quit spinning and literally Ooh. almost. He's got to still be down there. Well, you got a triple today. What's going on today? So it's interesting, we had a pretty busy morning during the uh, major and a uh, lot of action and we saw a bunch of real nice fish and it's interesting tonight we've literally been going back on a lot of the fish we had earlier the nicer ones we've seen none of them but we're still exploring and every time we go to a spot we haven't fished today we find fish there was two at this spot yeah there literally was another muskie right before this one that he missed so that 
crazy. This one's also got that weird that snaggle yeah. tooth. Snaggle tooth one there too. He's got the oh, big gash on his side too. <laughs> it has been a fun day though. We've actually dealt with a lot of fish today. It's actually been pretty neat. Uh, he's a new young angler, yeah. learning a lot. And he's really been learning a lot this whole trip, really. He really has. It's been interesting. And, you know, it's not very often you get three fish on a figure eight for a guy that, you know, started out with his first one today. It was literally his first one musky fishing. That's awesome, man. You know, that's an accomplishment. Yeah, Congrats. Congrats. You're going to get one more. I yeah, wish he's, we... he's about right in there. Yeah, he's right there. I think I can see him over there. <laughs> nice job, bud. I gotta, I gotta be honest. I was thinking about going home. Look at that tub. It's so hot. <laughs> Look at that tub. That's a dandy fish. Yeah. He's that's... gonna be 48. Oh, easy. easy. At least maybe more. Get a smile pick. <laughs> All right. Yeah, let's just let her go. She wants to go. She right. wants to get out. I don't blame her. We didn't have real hot weather, so we're the fish is in good shape. Oh yeah, the water is only 70. Damn dude, that's a nice fish. It's hot as hell today, but that was a tank. That was cool. That was fun. That was super cool. I'm going to give you a fish. <laughs> Bingo. Nice. Big fun. Old jerk master finally came through for me. Bouncing his head off the rocks. Damn. Was only catching pike, but I like it when I got to loosen the drag. Well, guys, we're on our way back home. It was a fun trip for Pete and I. Successful, eh, Pete? Well, it's always successful. Sometimes they're better than others, but we had a blast. We were in a beautiful place and we caught a few fish, so that's always good too. So if these guys want to ask about grass and arrows, what do they got to do? Get a hold of Wayne? That's it? Get a hold of King Wayne. Actually, Maria might uh, be able to help him out as well, but uh, yeah, yeah, Wayne's the guy and uh, check him out on their website, but give him a call. Uh, so wonderful place and great people. I always emphasize that because, uh, you know, anybody I guess could have a nice place, but they're nice people. They treat you well, fishing's great, view's great. You see four bears swimming around once in a while too, stuff like that. We saw lots of cool stuff and they really do accommodate you. I was on a diet, so they even made me some special food, so. Lasagna with no noodles Lasagna for Dave. With no noodles. 
So if I seem a little cranky, it's because I've got no carbs for the last. <laughs> it's been a little while since I've had a carb. I had a zucchini, zucchini noodle is what I got to have for my carb, I guess. Yeah. But uh, yeah, that's, that's it. But uh, we're on our way back home, had a great time. Met a new great friend, Rex. Rex is, uh, got, yeah. Rex is a lot of fun and uh, you'll probably see more of him in the future. Oh yeah, yeah, you're gonna see a lot of little Rex there, or old Rex, or whatever he is. What did you call him, Little Denny or something? Little like Denny, yeah. something like that. Yeah. All right guys, over and out, thanks for watching, and uh, don't forget, subscribe, hit that subscribe button if you like what we're doing.